Career of Virgil van Dyke Step into the compelling journey of Virgil van Dyke, a football luminary whose story transcends the pitch. Born on July 8, 1991 in Breda, Netherlands, van Dyke's tale unfolds against a backdrop of diversity and resilience. From early adversities to triumphs with Groningen, Celtic, and Liverpool, his trajectory is nothing short of inspirational. As he navigates the complexities of fame and family, questions arise. What fuels Van Dyke's unwavering dedication? How does he balance the demands of stardom with his commitment to privacy? Join us as we delve into the remarkable life of Virgil Van Dyke, a name synonymous with defensive brilliance and unwavering determination. Before we delve into that, we welcome you to Premier League Careers, where we provide you with the latest football information. So without further ado, let's get started. Early Life Virgil van Dyke, born on July 8, 1991, hails from Breda and comes from a diverse background with a Dutch father, Ron van Dyke, and an Afro-Surinamese mother, Helen Chin Fosiu. Raised in Kesteren, Breda, he faced family challenges when his father left when he was 11. Despite adversities, van Dyke's love for football flourished, playing in various settings from streets to organized matches. Beginning at WDS 19 and later joining Willem II at 8, he balanced football with a part-time dishwasher job as a teenager, initially a right back. His shift to central defense in 2008 marked a turning point, leading him to FC Groningen at 19, club career. Groningen Van Dyke faced challenges breaking into Groningen's main squad, initially seen as overtired from extensive play with Willem II. His professional debut in May 2011 saw him substitute for Petter Andersen, later scoring twice in a UEFA Europa League playoff match. During the 2011-12 Eredivisie season, he impressed with 23 appearances and his first regular season goal against Feyenoord. A setback hit when, just after turning 20, he faced appendicitis, peritonitis, and kidney poisoning requiring urgent, life-saving surgery. After a challenging recovery, Van Dijk returned in 2012, excelling in defense. Despite transfer interest, including from PSV and Ajax, he continued with Groningen. Celtic In June 2013, Virgil van Dijk joined Celtic for approximately £2.6 million, signing a four-year deal. Making his debut in August, he quickly became a key player. Scoring his first goals in November, he continued to shine with notable performances, including a solo-run goal in December. The 2013-14 season saw him contribute significantly, securing wins and earning a spot in the PFA Scotland Team of the Year. The following season, he showcased his scoring prowess, netting crucial goals. Despite facing challenges like a red card and a cup semi-final loss, Van Dyke's impactful play helped Celtic win the league again. Southampton, on the closing day of the 2015 transfer window, Virgil van Dyke secured a five-year deal with Premier League side Southampton for a reported £13 million becoming the most expensive Dutch defender since Jayapstam. Debuting in September, he quickly made an impact, scoring his first goal two weeks later. Van Dyke's stellar performance earned him Player of the Year honors from both teammates and fans. Despite injury setbacks and transfer rumors in the 2016-17 season, he captained Southampton. However, by the 2017-18 season, Van Dyke's desire to move led to a transfer request eventually resulting in his movie to Liverpool in January 2018. Liverpool In the 2017-18 season, Virgil van Dijk made a groundbreaking move to Liverpool for a reported £75 million, setting a potential world record for a defender. His debut in the FA Cup against Everton saw him score the winning goal, showcasing his immediate impact. Partnering with Dejan Lovren, he bolstered Liverpool's defence, earning praise for his composure. Despite a Champions League final loss, Van Dyke played a crucial role in Liverpool's resurgence. The following season saw him excel, winning numerous awards and contributing to Liverpool's triumphs. However, a significant setback occurred in the 2020-21 season when he suffered a serious knee injury. After a successful return, Van Dyke became Liverpool's captain in the 2023-24 season, but faced disciplinary issues, receiving a red card and subsequent ban. International Career on May 12, 2010, Virgil van Dijk marked his debut with the Netherlands under-19 in a friendly against South Korea under-19. Progressing to the under-21s on November 14, 2011, in a qualifier against Scotland under-21, 
he played two more friendlies. Although selected thrice in 2014 for the senior team, his debut was delayed. The breakthrough came on October 10, 2015, in a UEFA Euro 2016 qualifier against Kazakhstan. Despite missing the 2016-2017 World Cup qualifiers due to injury, he emerged as the captain under Ronald Koeman in 2018. Van Dijk's leadership included vital goals, notably in the UEFA Nations League, guiding the Netherlands to the final. In 2022, he captained the Dutch team in the FIFA World Cup, reaching the quarterfinals style of play. Virgil van Dijk, a robust right-footed centre-back, typically holds the left side of central defence, though he's versatile. Known for his pace, technical prowess, and goal-scoring ability, he excels in set-pieces. Former teammate Kreis comments praised his comfort on the ball, technique, and powerful right foot. Scouts commend his ideal defender profile, citing smooth ball-playing skills, aerial strength, dead ball expertise, and leadership. Despite occasional lapses in focus, his tactical awareness and all-around skills have improved in the English league. Lionel Messi highlighted Van Dijk's timing, agility, and goal-scoring prowess. Widely regarded as the world's best defender, he earned praise from legends like Vincent Kompany and Erling Haaland. Personal life Van Dijk opts to display only his first name on his kit, a choice linked to a family dispute with his father who left during Virgil's childhood. As revealed by his uncle Stephen, Virgil maintains privacy on the matter, stating, It's nobody's business, but my father is no longer in my life. Virgil and his wife, Reich Noigedit, whom he met at 20, married in 2017, and are parents to four children. Van Dyke, with Chinese ancestry through his mother, Helen Chin Fosiu, respects his family history, which trace back to his maternal great-grandfather, who migrated from Guangdong to Suriname in 1920 career statistics club. Van Dyke's football journey reflects a remarkable career trajectory. Beginning at Groningen in the Eredivisie, he showcased his skills, tallying 66 appearances and seven goals across three seasons. His move to Celtic in the Scottish Premiership marked a significant chapter, contributing 115 appearances and 15 goals during his time. Southampton in the Premier League witnessed Van Dyke's defensive prowess with 80 appearances and 7 goals. The defining phase unfolded at Liverpool, where he became a defensive stalwart, amassing 233 appearances and 19 goals, showcasing his impact in league competitions and European tournaments. With a career total of 494 appearances and 48 goals, Van Dyke's journey stands as a testament to his footballing excellence. International Virgil van Dijk's international journey with the Netherlands showcases a consistent and impactful presence. Since making his debut in 2015, he has accumulated 62 appearances, contributing 7 goals as of October 16, 2023. His goal-scoring moments include significant occasions like a friendly against Portugal in March 2018 and crucial UEFA Nations League matches against Germany in October 2018 and November 2018. Van Dyke's proficiency extends to UEFA Euro and FIFA World Cup qualifiers, displaying his defensive prowess and occasional goal-scoring flair. As a key figure in the Dutch national team, he continues to leave his mark on the international stage, making valuable contributions in pursuit of success. Honors Virgil van Dyke's illustrious career has been adorned with numerous team and individual honors. During his time with Celtic, he secured the Scottish Premiership titles in 2013-14 and 2014-15, along with the Scottish League Cup in 2014-15. Upon joining Liverpool, his impact was monumental, contributing to the Premier League triumph in 2019-20, the FA Cup in 2021-22, and the EFL Cup in 2021-22. The UEFA Champions League victory in 2018-19 further solidified his legacy. Individually, Van Dyke's accolades include the prestigious PFA Players Player of the Year 2018-19, UEFA Men's Player of the Year 2018-19, and multiple inclusions in UEFA Teams of the Year. His consistent excellence has earned him widespread recognition and numerous awards, marking him as one of football's true defensive icons. In conclusion, Virgil van Dijk's journey from the streets of Breda to becoming a defensive icon is a testament to his resilience and footballing excellence. With honors at Groningen, Celtic, and Southampton, and a transformative role at Liverpool, he has left an indelible mark on the sport. As a Dutch captain, 
His international impact is equally profound. Beyond the pitch, Virgil's personal life reflects a commitment to family and privacy. Despite challenges, he stands tall as a leader, earning accolades and respect globally. What's next for this defensive maestro? How will his legacy evolve on and off the field? Only time will tell in the captivating story of Virgil van Dyke. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Your support means a lot to us, and it helps us create more great content. See you in the next video.